we are discussing about gate solutions for 2005 ECE paper topic we are discussing is electron devices this is fifth question came in two mark series and the circuit given is a simple zener voltage regulator the zener diode in the regulator circuit has a zener voltage of 5.8 volts and a zener knee current of 0.5 milli amperes the maximum load current drawn from this circuit ensuring proper functioning over the input voltage range between 20 and 30 volts is a 23.7 milli amperes b 14.2 milli amperes c 13.7 milli amperes d 24.2 milli amperes correct answer for this question is 23.7 milli amperes so zener diode can act as voltage regulator if the zener diode is in zener breakdown region the given parameters are iz knee that is zener knee current zener knee current is also called as minimum zener current required for proper functioning as voltage regulator that is 0.5 milli amperes so zener current minimum of 0.5 milli amperes should go through the zener diode so that it will be in breakdown region and zener breakdown voltage is given as 5.8 volts we need to calculate maximum load current whenever the input is changing from 20 to 30 volts so for the given zener voltage regulator circuit we are indicating the current directions look at this one iz current flowing through zener diode since the zener diode is under zener breakdown region which occurs under reverse bias so that current always flows from n to p so the direction is going to be as shown it is from n to p so iz is shown in this way next load current is flowing towards rl that is il and is is nothing but source current which is coming from the input side whenever it is acting as zener voltage regulator it maintains constant voltage so for this rs one side is going to be constant that is output voltage which is going to be constant at 5.8 volts and current flowing through this rs now depends on v input voltage so if v input is maximum at that time current flowing through rs will be maximum so that whenever v in is changing from 20 to 30 volts maximum current flows through rs when v input is 30 volts so since vz is constant that is one side of rs is constant is will be maximum when v input is 30 volts that's why we are going with v input as 30 volts so that we can expect maximum supply current which is coming from the input and that is going into divided into zener current as well as load current we need to calculate maximum load current so from this diagram a simple equation can be written using current division rule is is equal to iz plus il this current is is dividing into two parts so that it is iz plus il whenever v input is 30 volts at that time is is maximum that is maximum can be written as iz minimum plus il maximum because this is maximum and it is constant so if it is minimum definitely the entire current has to go through that load so that that will be treated as maximum load current so is maximum is equal to iz minimum plus il maximum where il maximum is nothing but is maximum minus iz minimum we can write the same equation is maximum minus iz minimum is given as 0.5 milli amperes how to calculate this is maximum is maximum is nothing but 30 minus 5.8 volts divided by rs rs value given as 1 kilo ohm in the circuit diagram so 30 minus 5.8 minus by 1 kilo ohm which is 24.2 milli amperes is maximum is 24.2 milli amperes and il maximum is nothing but 24.2 minus 0.5 so that the maximum load current is 23.7 milli amperes so 
The right answer for the given question is A. 23.7 milliampere. Thank you.